Yeah. I also thought I would show you some of the location based services. In the main menu you have them under location. If you go into location you basically have the settings for, for GPS data and positioning etc. And then you have Google Maps which you're probably familiar with from the web and from, from other mobile phones where you can of course zoom into the map, zoom out, uh, choose to use the satellite view instead. Of course it needs an internet connection and shows beautiful pictures of Stockholm here where I am. Uh, besides that you also have a fully fledged turn-by-turn uh, -turn navigation application called WisePilot. In there you, you need a GPS connection which it could be hard to get since I'm indoors right now but let's see if it works. You have your favorites where you actually store your, your uh, favorite destinations. You can show the map, uh, you can find different things for example, you can search for, for person, businesses, addresses, and also positions, of course, but, but also near me, where you can choose from different uh, different things like uh, restaurants, culture, shopping, money, etc. Since I don't have a GPS connection here now, it, it won't make sense to show that. Uh, that's basically a navigation solution for when you're in the car or when you're walking. Actually, now I've got... GPS connection, so let's look, let's look for restaurants nearby. Here I have some to choose from. And if I, if I choose one, sorry. let's go in again. For each of these destinations, I can show, of course choose to drive here or walk here and then it will calculate the route for me. Now I lost the GPS again. Let's see how I should walk. Pretty cool.